tell people that I live on an island in San Francisco Bay, they give me a very strange look because they think I'm talking about Alcatraz. Well, I'm not. I'm talking about the island city of Alameda here in the East Bay. And in this video, I'm going to share my top five favorite things about living here. And I'm going to start right now. Hey guys, Hans Strazina with the Gunderman Group at Keller Williams Luxury International uh, coming to you with another video. This time we're talking about the town that I call home, Alameda. Yes, it is an island here in the San Francisco Bay, though it didn't always used to be. Um, but what I'm really wanting to go into is my top five favorite reasons for living here and why so many other people and clients have told me they love moving here as well. I am gonna be doing a series about the city and I'm gonna move into some other cities later, but I'm gonna start here in Alameda. So make sure you subscribe to the channel, hit the bell, give it a thumbs up because you're not gonna to wanna to miss any of the content that I'm putting out here about the island city. So without any further ado, let's get into it. All right, reason number one that I love Alameda, it's because it's flat. Now, a lot of people look at me and think that's kind of a weird reason to like a city, but here's why I tell people that. Uh, number one, makes it really easy to get around. Uh, for those of you who are looking for a high walkability score, uh, this is your spot. Uh, it's really easy to bike or walk or jog if you're into fitness uh, around this island and really get anywhere almost as fast as you could with a car. Uh, I find that when on Friday night I go into Park Street for dinner and meet uh, with Kristen and uh, we go in oftentimes by bike and tie them up somewhere outside the restaurant and go in and, and walk because, you know, frankly, parking can be kind of a pain in the butt. So it's very possible to have a walkability score uh, pretty much from anywhere on the island. Not to mention the fact that all the lots, at least for single family homes, are going to have some kind of a yard. And even if it's a small yard, it's pretty usable. So you can put a garden out there, a patio, a sitting area, a deck, whatever you want to do, it's all very possible. Compare that up into the hills in Berkeley and Oakland. You may have a larger lot, but it won't be usable in the same way just because of the grade of the lot. Um, so all of that combined really makes for a nice living environment. Reason number two I love living in Alameda is the speed limit on basically the entire island is 25 miles an hour. It uh, doesn't matter if it's a small, very tight street or Lincoln, which is a two uh, lane in each direction through fare uh, that goes the length of the island. It's all 25. Uh, why do I like this? Number one, it sort of represents a little slower pace of life that we have here. Being in the middle of the Bay Area, the hustle and the bustle, as soon as you get into Alameda, everything just slows down a little bit. It kind of uh, makes for a nice... Uh, more relaxed experience as soon as you get back onto the island uh, or someone comes to visit, they'll notice everything just slows down. Plus it makes it a lot safer if you're gonna walk, you're gonna bike, you're gonna jog um, all over the place because there are a lot of opportunities as I mentioned in the previous point for that. And uh, it just is a space that you can really feel comfortable outside, uh, out in the public because you know there's not gonna be a whole lot of uh, speed racers coming around. Reason number three that I love Alameda is the food scene. Uh, now, I'm not necessarily saying that it's going to rival or exceed the gourmet ghetto up in Berkeley or the Temescal or Rock Ridge uh, food scene at the moment, but it is growing and getting better. For those of us who live in Alameda and just don't want to get off the island uh, for a nice dinner, we have a lot of options actually. Uh, Town Tavern is one that I really love. They've got a fantastic cocktail list and a growing menu. American Oak just around the corner, same thing. Um, and then Burmese food, you've got Burma Superstar on Park Street as well. Uh, so those are all great destinations and places that fill up pretty quickly on Friday and Saturday night. So make sure you plan ahead for those. If you go down to South Shore, uh, where the shopping plaza is, you can go meet Giuseppe, who's the owner and head chef at Traboco. Amazing Italian food, awesome for a date night or a special occasion. Not to be outdone, 
Uh, the West End has a pretty amazing food scene as well. You've got uh, Neptunes as well as Cafe Jolie that have pretty fantastic brunch and lunch options. Same thing with West Cafe awesome cappuccinos and sandwiches and a beautiful outdoor deck space. And then the Hunter uh, has uh, an amazing cocktail menu and a lounge atmosphere. So wonderful options over there as well. The fourth reason I love living in Alameda is it's accessible. Even though we've got a little bit of an oasis, it's slower, it's flat, it's got a great food scene. It's easy to get out of here and go check out some of the other amazing places uh, in Oakland, in San Francisco, wherever you may be going. Uh, obviously, there's bridges uh, that go onto the east end and over to Harbor Bay Bay Farm. You've got the tunnel up at the west end that takes you right into downtown Oakland. For commuters, you're only a few minutes away from the Fruitvale BART station where many people go in the morning uh, to take the BART train into the city. But you've also got two ferries, one up at the West End uh, that uh, takes you right downtown. Same thing over on Harbor Bay, uh, direct commuter ferries into downtown San Francisco. And of course, there are Transbay bus options, um, as well as a Google and Facebook bus uh, that takes you right down to the campuses in the South Bay. Lastly, this one's sort of overlooked a lot of the times, but the proximity to Oakland Airport is unreal. Uh, I personally take about seven minutes door to door to get there when I'm gonna go fly somewhere um, out of that airport, and I can't tell you how nice it is to not have to tack on 45 minutes to get over to SFO. So the fifth reason I love living here in Alameda is it's just beautiful. Uh, almost everywhere you look, there is a tree lining up and down a street. There are many streets like Central or Gibbons uh, that have just tons of trees up and down and it creates this very cool canopy effect. Um, not to mention that just throughout the year, those leaves change, the colors change, uh, the flowers, all the stuff that comes with sort of the natural beauty here uh, just brings this place to life in special ways relative to the seasons. And to top it off, there's a just an unbelievable diversity of architecture. Obviously, everybody knows about uh, the Victorian style homes that are uh, famous here in Alameda, but there's many other styles um, just diversified all over the island from Queen Anne revivals to craftsman bungalow cottages uh, to Mediterranean you know really whatever style of home you're looking for you can find it here um, and then it's just accented by all this amazing foliage around and that's it that is my list top five reasons that I love to live in Alameda hopefully you got some value out of that uh, like I said in the intro, I am going to be creating more specific Alameda content. Um, I'm going to be starting with some neighborhood features to really break down the neighborhoods for you and then talk about some more of the lifestyle things here on the island city. So make sure you subscribe to the channel, give the video a thumbs up and click the little bell uh, so you don't miss any notifications of new content that I put out on a weekly basis. Uh, so guys, thank you so much for tuning in. This is Hans Strazini with the Gunderman Group at Keller Williams Luxury International, signing off. See you on the next one.